x and y be the value of the joint PDF given by this one. So you have been told find the expected value of summation of x. So, so for this one will be I got to say summation of x is equal to summation of O y summation of O x x times function of x y. So our limit is x is equal to from 0 to 2 and y from 0 to 2. So for this one we shall say summation of x is equal to 0 to 2 y is equal to from 0 to 2 x so we shall say x from 0 to 2 x x 0 y is set from 0 plus x 1 plus x 2 so uh, 2 starts from 0 to 0 1 2 so for this one we are going to substitute with these values so we are going to start with we can eliminate 0 because when you multiply a number by 0 we get a 0 so we can start by 1 we start by 1 1 0 plus 1 1 1 plus 1 1 2 we go to when x go to 2 so we are going to get 2 2 0 plus 2 1 then 2 2 2 so for this one we are going to look from the table 1 0 x 1 0 we get 9 we go to 1 1 1 1 we get this one we go to 1 2 1 2 we get 0 we go to 2 0 we get this one we go to 2 2 1 2 1 we get 0 we got 2, 2, 2, 2 is equal to 0. So we get, first of all, we'll get 1, one 0 is equal to 9 over 28 plus 1, 1. 1, 1, we get 6 or 28. 6 over 28. We got to 2, 0. That means 2, x equal to 2 times this one. So we're going to get plus 2 times 3 over 28 so we are going to get 21 over 28 which is equal to 3 over 4 so we are through with this one we go to this one so we see expect the value of y is equal to o y for x, y, function of x, y. So that means x start from 0 to 2, y start from 0 to 2, y, function of x, y. So we can substitute the values of x. So we are going to get y, function of 0, y, plus y, 1, y, plus 2, y. All expected values of y, that means they start from 0, this one start from 0 to 2. So, so we are going to get 1, 
zero. So we are going to remit zero because when this y is equal to zero, we get zero. So we can remit zero we start with one. Plus when one one when x is equal to one plus one one two plus when x is equal to two I'm going to two zero two Go to two one two plus plus two two two. So after this one, so we are going to get one one zero one. So you come here. 0, 1, get this one. We go to 1, 1, 1, 1, and get this one. We go to 1, 2, 1, 2, get 0. We go to 1, 0, 2, and get is equal to this one. 2, 2 is equal to 0. So we have 0, 1. 0, 1, get 6 over 28 plus 1, 1, it's equal to 6 over 28 plus 0, 2, 0, 2, we get 1 over 28 times this 2, so you get 2 times 1 over 28, so you are going to get 14 over 28, which is equal to a half. So summation of y is equal to a half. So we come here. Summation of summation of x squared. So you can come here. Summation of x squared. So this one is x. So when we square this one, become squared. So only the one we are going to multiply is this one. This one is equal to one. You square here. We square here. So when we square here, we are going to get 4. So we are going to get 9 over 28 plus 6 over 28 plus this one is equal to 4. 2 squared is equal to 4 times 3 over 28. So we are going to get 12 over 28. So 12 plus 6 and get 18. 18 plus 8 and get 27. So you get summation of x squared equal to 20. 27 over 28. So summation of x squared is equal to 27 over 28. Because when you square, so summation of squared is equal to x squared. Summation function of x, y. That way is this one. We square the x. So you can come here the way we have told you. We square this only this one. When we square this one, so we are going to get this one should be squared, one squared, one squared, one squared, two squared, two squared, two squared. That's why this one is one. Coefficient of this one is one squared, one squared, these two squared. So when you hand, so you are going to get 27 over 28. So when you come from this one, summation of summation of y squared which is equal to y squared function of x, y. So you are coming here. When this one is squared, so you get this one is having coefficient 1 squared, 1 squared, this one 2 squared. So you are going to get 6 plus 2. Yeah, 6 plus 6, 12. 12, this one is 2 times 2, you get 4. So 12 plus 4. So you get 16 over 28, which is equal to 4 over 7. So for this one, you get, this one is equal to 4 over 7. This one is equal to 27 over 28. So you come to variance of x.
variance of x. So variance of x is equal to summation of x squared minus summation of x, all of them squared. So we are going to get some x squared is equal to this one 20, 27 over 28 minus summation of x is equal to 1 over 3 over 4. You get 3 over 4, all of them squared. So you are going to get our answer is. 45 over 112. So, so when we come to variance of x, variance of y, sorry. So we are through with this one, this one, so we are here. Variance of y. We are going to see, it's equal to expected values of y squared minus expected value of y squared, that one. So for this one we get the y squared we get four four over seven minus for the y we get a half this one a half so we are going to see minus a half in squared so we are going to get this one will be nine over twenty eight so we come to the last part this one. Expected value of x y. So expected value of x y is equal to O x summation of O y x y function of x y that one. So we are going to start from x start from zero to two. Summation from of y is equal Start from 0 to 2, x, y, function of x, y. So for this one, is set from where you substitute the values of y from 0 to 2. I'm going to see summation of x set from 0 to 2. Set from when x times 0, function of x, 0. Plus x times 1, function of x1, plus 2 times x, function of x2, that one. So this one becomes 0, so we can eliminate this one. Because any number times 0, we get 0, so we can deal with this one. So we are going to say, we set from... And you can start from 1 times 1. When x is equal to 1, we start here. 1, 1, plus 1 times 2, plus. When you start from 2 times 2, so you get 2 times 0. Although this one is 0, when x is equal to 2, plus. When x got to 2 times 1, to 1, plus 2 times 2, to 2. So this one is 0. We can eliminate this one. So we are going to get 1, 1, 1, plus 2, 1, 2, plus 2, to 1, plus 4, to 2. So when we take from our our table here, we are going to get one 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 is equal to this one. We go to one two one two is equal to zero. We go to two one two one is equal to zero. We go to two 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 is equal to zero. So we have only this one. So we can see expected value of x y. It's equal to 6 over 28. That is the final answer. Kindly like, subscribe, and share. You can ask any question you want to ask. This is the Mathematic Club, the Raka Mathematic Club. So you are allowed to comment with any question, or you can post to our FB group.
Tharaka University Mathematics Club. Thank you.